So I guess it's fair to say, case open. My God, I have goose flesh. So now I'd like to move on to a real suspect. I want to see Detective Diaz in the box. <gasps> what? Don't gasp for him. What are you doing? I'm sorry, he just slipped out. The title of your sex tape. What? Yeah, obviously, it's the title of the sex tape. Everyone's taking my stuff. We need two undercovers at the DeKalb Street Warehouse party. Uh, Boyle, you're already in costume as uh, Joy Behar. I'm Mario Batali. Okay. And uh, Santiago, you go with him. Yes, sir. Damn it. Santiago, I know that you hate Halloween, but stick with me and I promise you, you will love it. Can you magically make everyone kind, sober, and fully dressed? Kind, sober, and fully dressed. Good news, everyone. We found the name of Santiago's sex tape. What is all this? You know how I think Halloween is for jerks? Well, this Halloween, I was the jerk. I'm sorry about tonight. I'm sorry about tonight. We found the title for Santiago's follow-up sex tape. <laughs> I'm sorry I couldn't convince you to love Halloween. It's not your fault. I was terrible. It's not your fault I was terrible is also one of your sex tapes. Halloween is unbearable, but it was slightly less unbearable with you. Don't. Oh, this is so cool. You can shoot around corners. I love guns. I'm gonna make such a good dad. Not even gonna touch that. The Amy Santiago story. All right, the linoleum awaits, my dear. Oh boy. I know we're undercover, but I'm starting to get real nervous about this contest. You need to see a therapist. Yeah. It stands this way. Okay. Ow! How did you manage to step on both of my feet at the same time? I'm horrible at this. When can we stop? I'm horrible at this. When I can we stop? I know, I know. Title of my sex tape. Yeah, well done. Title of my sex tape. Hey. Oh Got your drink. Thanks. What is this? Champagne mixed with 30-year-old scotch and top shelf tequila. Captain said a two drink max, but he did not set a price limit. Smart. Hmm. Oh God, it's horrible. Yeah, I shouldn't have added the olive juice. Ew. <sighs> hey, so listen, the thing I said to you before I went undercover about how I wish something had happened between us romantically, that wasn't nothing. That was real. What are you saying? I know that you're with Teddy. I'm not trying to change that. And I get there's stuff I can't control. But this morning I told you that I didn't mean any of it and that was a lie. I just don't want to hold anything back. Well, thank you for saying that. Just as long as we're clear that I'm with someone and nothing is gonna happen. I'm with someone, nothing's gonna happen. Name your sex tape. He's back. <laughs> I did something really stupid. I need your help. You know, I'm kind of a sexy bad boy who rides motorcycles into work and is always breaking the rules in the name of justice. I don't like where this is going. Well, I also maybe sometimes bring home case files to work on them after hours, and I might not be that great about returning them. Oh, God. Are you aroused because of what a bad boy I am? No. No. You could be suspended for that. He could think you're the mole. Sure, not so loud. Yes, Amy, I do drink from the bowl. Definitely pulled that off. Look, I need to get those files. Can you please give me a ride? Fine. I'll get my stuff, but this better not bite me in the ass. Better not bite me in the ass, name of your sex tape, but seriously, thank you so much for your help. Santiago, Diaz, before you go, both of you requested to have this Saturday off, but I need one of you to work. Oh, I can take that shift. Well, the last time you worked a Saturday, you watched cartoons the entire time. Well, that's when they're on. Work this out and get back to me. Sorry, I can't reschedule. I have tickets to a TED Talk on power poses and getting what you want by using your body. Uh-oh. I hope it doesn't get too sexual. Uh-oh, I hope it doesn't get too sexual. Title of your sex tape. But seriously, what is taking so long? Also the title of your sex tape. Yeek. Blast of cold air coming out of that box. Name of Amy's sex tape. Hey, man, come on. Not cool. I'm going through something. Just let me have this one. We'll crack it. I'm gonna go grab some coffee. Great. <clears throat> mm. Hey, uh, now that it's just us, there's a thing I wanted to say, uh, does a uh, you? Why doesn't your mouth work? Why doesn't your mouth work? Title of our sex tape. What? Your sex tape. What? No. Uh, sorry, I think I'm feeling a little awkward. Yeah, me too. How do we make it not weird? I know. Let's just get super drunk. Yes, great idea. Pardon me, ma'am. Could you please bring us four kamikaze shots? And four for me as well. Ah. I like your style. See, we can do this. We're back on track. We're keeping it light and breezy. So, we broke a rule. Yeah, I hope it wasn't a mistake. Hope it wasn't a mistake. Title your sex tape.
<gasps> Title of our sex tape. How do you explain this? I have no idea. I put the plaque in my office. Cheddar? Come here, come here, come here, baby. What the hell? Yeah, thank you. Return to my office, please. What's up, you little turds? Wait, what is going on? We have the plaque. Yeah, I just got it out of the vent to rub it in your faces. I just got it out of the vent to rub it in your faces, name your sex tape. What? Oh, no. Rosa, we don't have any more prongs. We're prongless. Oh, and one more thing. They're guilty. No, we are not. Please do not address the jury, Mr. Peralta. But, but, but. One more but and you will be in contempt. One more but and you're contempt, name your sex tape. Look, we all miss Jake and Rosa, which is why we have to keep working the case. There has to be some way to exonerate them. I've been looking, but I can't find anything, and I don't know what to do. I can't find anything, and I don't know what to do. Title of your sex tape. What is happening right now? I'm so confused. I don't know what's happening right now. I'm so confused. I don't know what's happening right now. Title of your sex tape. <sighs> oh, my god. I'm shaking. I'm definitely going to cry. Title of your sex tape. Perhaps you two would take me to a meeting of Gamblers Anonymous. Absolutely. And Jake, before we go. I need to admit one more thing. Of course, anything. When I made you tell that table that you were living in your mother's basement, it wasn't for the case. I was just messing with you. <sighs> well played, sir. But the joke's on you. My mother has a fantastic basement. Title your sex tape. Too soon? All right, let's go. Peralta, what do you have to say for yourself? The whole NYPD knows where you are, and they're coming for you right now. OK, thanks for the tip. Let's kill them both, get out of here before the cops come. Wait, no, 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 I was lying about the backup. I came alone, title of my sex tape. I hate to ask this, but have you considered shutting the truck down? You're always bragging about how much Boyle's love to give up. I can't, I'm in so much debt. I took out a loan for the truck. I got Amy to invest. No, the only way out of this hole is to keep digging. That's not how holes work, title of your sex tape. Is this gonna be one of those scavenger hunts, Boyle? Cause that pasta pot isn't filling itself. Come on, Terry, let's just see what the plan is. Charles, what are we doing? I don't know anything about it, but why don't we take this map and this sextant and chart a course to the restaurant. Title of your sextant tape. Ah, did not work at all, but I love that you attempted it. Title of your sextant tape. All right, let's go. You're getting married right here, right now. What? Come on, Boyle, I don't even have a dress. You can wear Gina's. I'm sure it's white. There's no way Gina was going to wear a white dress to my wedding. No, I definitely was. What? I thought you'd just wear a gray pantsuit or something. I would never wear a gray pantsuit to your wedding. I promise you that. This is happening. Jake and Amy are getting married tonight. Title of my sex tape. What? Oh! Good morning, Captain Holt. You're looking refreshed. Interesting. I didn't sleep a wink. Let's just say Kevin no longer has me in the guest room. Nice. My two dads straight smashing it. <laughs> Sorry, that came out weird. Title of your sex tape. But more importantly, how did it go with Commissioner Kelly? So you think he killed her and dumped her body in the park? Oh, sounds like couples counseling is going really great for them. <sighs> Sorry, my partner doesn't believe in therapy. Oh, that's fine. It's hard for some people. A title of your sex tape. Hey, what's up? I came as fast as I could. Title of your sex tape. Nailed it. Worst morning ever. Yeah, it was stressful, but we got the guy. Surprised you two were taking it so hard. We were talking about our lunch, you self-absorbed son of a bitch. Come on. Look at this bread. It's completely inedible. There's not even any soft parts in the middle we can pull out. Title of your sex tape? I know what you're thinking. Where them guts go? Uh, yeah. This guy needs a dentist because he's got a big old cavity. I love that. I'm stealing it. You cannot steal what is a gift. Thank you. OK, so whoever did this, they weren't careful with the organs. They just sort of grabbed whatever and yanked. Title of your sex tape. Oh, that's just something we say back at the 9-9. Interesting, because around here, sex tape is what we call the adhesive you use to reattach a severed penis. Oh, I'll have to pick some of that up. Why? Hey, hey, Captain. What delicious water I'm drinking. <laughs> Sorry that we didn't check in before we left. We're just down at the DMV following up on those Saturn owners. Lies. <laughs> Captain, how'd you know we were here? I followed you. John Kelly gave you a hot glue, didn't he? How dare you disobey me? Come on, sir. It was a good tip, and we're trying to catch a serial killer. Well, then, let's see this tip, this groundbreaking tip that threatens to blow the case wide open. OK, I know this tone. Here comes Petty Holt. Nah, bitch, I'm not being petty. You just said, nah, bitch. Show me the tip. <sighs> Title your sex tape. You got her meeting the mayor, her dog sitting for Bo Obama, Malala giving her an award, but no photos of lunch. That's because vampires don't appear on film. Perhaps we should be looking for a 17th century woodblock print. Good idea. Let's keep moving. Hello? She's coming, hide. Title your sex tape. 
get here. Is this about the tickets? It is indeed about said tickets, and said proclamation about said tickets is in fact. Jay, just tell us. No one is liking this. I'm loving it. You sound so smart. Oh, thank you, my loyal subject, Charles. Now, as you know, this decision has been quite hard upon me, title of mine, sex tape, but I have made it at long last. You know, I always hoped that I could reconcile things with him one day, but he's not gonna let that happen. What can I tell you? We're not meant to have sons. There's a demon in our genes. Title of your sex tape? No, the title of my sex tape is Cockpit Larry and the Mile High Steward Eye. What? Steward Eye. It's plural for stewardess. Yeah, okay. 